Sam, DNA, Dene, that's me. The DNA of Reno government, and I don't know how long this gentleman has been in the meeting, so he saw me. I've never seen him before, and I probably he's never seen me before, and this might have, my public comment might have been his first introduction to me, and I did not want to think that that was the, um, the regular Sam Dene. Although you can ask the media mouse wacko freaks, and they'll say, yes, that is the regular Sam Dene, as I lead in. The, uh, I used to go to the library all of the time, and then I got onto the Internet and all that other kind of stuff, just like everybody else, and I have not really heard a word about the library, I, I don't think, in five years or something. And this was, I'm really glad I stayed here to hear this. This, this is great, that family, I guess, who was the inspiration or the... Um, instigators of this situation with the eight hundred thousand dollar donation in a in their will that's a phenomenal deal i'm hoping there's going to be some kind of a nice plaque or maybe even a statue for them he's he's nodding his head so uh, i thought that at least one citizen albeit it's the dna of reno government um and i don't really want any plaques or statues although i really deserve They've been give out, they give it out the Citizen of the Year Award every year, and they, I've never gotten one, but that's okay because they're waiting to give me the C Citizen of the Decades. That's pro plural. And I do, really don't understand why the Media Mouse Wacko Freaks are so scared of me. I've got the greatest story in the history of America right in front of them. A typical reporter would say, my God, this is like a gold mine. Instead, they bury their heads in the sand and act like this 10-ton elephant is not in the room. Go figure. Thank you, thank you, and thank you for all your good work. All right, Sam, great comments on the library. We appreciate it.